Hi guys. Um, good morning. It's Lindsay. Um, if you don't know me, my name is Lindsay Krantz and I own Strand Salon in Corning, New York. And I specialize in color and natural beaded rose extensions. Um, and this is my morning. So I just wanted to say hello. Good morning. And uh, what I wanted to talk about this morning really fast is actually really fast mornings. And one of the things that I have been loving about wearing my natural beaded rows lately is I've been wearing them smooth. And my new favorite tool, you have probably seen me talk about this before. It's from Amika. It is the straightening brush 2.0. It is my absolute ride or die. I love it so much. I've used it all week. So I shampooed on Saturday, blew dry, smoothed it. And then Sunday, I didn't have to do anything. I sleep with just a loose ponytail. I haven't been braiding it. Normally, if I curl it, I do braid it, or actually I do like a two-strand locking twist, and that just keeps the shape a little bit better. Um, so the last couple of mornings, I mean, this morning I got in the shower. I just clipped my hair up with like a headband and stuff and took a shower, but I did not wash my hair. So today is the first day that I put in dry shampoo. And when I'm getting the kids ready for school in the morning, um, sometimes, well, actually lately, CJ's been taking them in for me. So it's allowed me a little bit more time after they leave um, to get stuff ready. But honestly, I've been catching up on dishes and laundry because it's easier to get that done when I have the time in the morning than it is at night when I get home. So I've been working on just making my mornings like super quick and easy to refresh. And so today after I got out of the shower and got dressed, I put my hair, I put dry shampoo, I used the Amica um, dry shampoo all over underneath and let that soak in for just a couple of minutes and then just kind of worked it in with my hands. And I have just been really embracing the long, straight, just smooth, not really, a, well, maybe more of a 70s vibe, but that's kind of what I've had in mind when I've been getting ready in the morning. So because it is fall, I did deepen up my hair a little bit, and I'm really, really liking it. So I have actually switched my makeup, and so I've just been experimenting the last couple of mornings um, just with a little bit more of, well, still a little bit of glow. I'm using the Glam Glow Nude Glow um, cream for my base, um, underneath my foundation and then concealer and then I'm still using the Anastasia brow powder to define my brows but instead of using the lighter one I'm using the darker one and just going a little bit stronger on the definition there still nothing I guess I need to fix that line <laughs> see when you're quick sometimes you miss those little details so I might need to fix that later um, but just super quick um, a little black liner, um, just not the felt tip. I can't do that quickly. So I use just a regular, like a soft coal one and just along the lash line, a little bit of a warmer brown mid-tone through my, my crease because my eyes are fairly hooded and the older I get, the more <laughs> they drag down. So I just like a little definition there at the brow bone. Um, Non-sparkly bronzer, just for a little um, warmth and definition under my cheekbones, jaw, around my face and then instead of using highlighter I have just been using the blush um, my favorite right now is NARS obviously it's the orgasm and it's got a beautiful pink with flecks of like gold in it and it does give I don't know if you can see with this lighting um, you still get a little bit of that glow um, and it just helps warm up your cheeks and gives your face that three-dimensional look that you really need to have that just fresh look that that's better you can see that a little bit better so instead of doing a separate highlighter as well I've just been using products that have just a hint of glow in them and that way I don't feel like a disco ball which typically is my favorite style but um, and then I added a little lipstick this is oh my gosh old faithful Revlon Super Lustrous Cream from, you know, it's my ride or die from forever. This is actually pearl. This is coffee. And it looks super scary in the tube sometimes. I mean, it's taking it back to like the 90s for that. Um, but just a little bit more definition, a little bit more tone, and um, of course, finish with several coats of black mascara. I'm using the Hourglass Caution Mascara. It is 
um, like my new favorite and I have repurchased it twice. Um, yeah, so it really has been easy. I mean, without talking about it, I got ready in like eight minutes. It takes no time to re-smooth with my Amika straightening brush. And then a little dry shampoo, I just kind of teased it up a little bit. And then really the makeup, super fast. But um, I will end up, I will have to take my extensions out probably before I get my move up because I'll be going to California in um, mid-November and that's when I'll be getting my move up. So um, length of time in between move ups, I don't wanna go too long because it's just not, it's just, you want them fresh. Um, so. The problem is when I have them out, my hair takes me a lot more work and I have to wash it more often, I have to style it more often, and then it just it doesn't look like I've done my hair even after I spend 15 minutes curling it. So NBR has saved my mornings and I still look polished, pulled together, and I can be an actual grown up <laughs> with a little bit of style. Um, so it's really helped my mornings. So. If you want to know more about that, you can click the learn more button or just comment below and I'll send you the link. Or if you just want to find more information on like what I do with NBR and that kind of stuff, go to my website, strandsaloncorning.com. There's a tab called Natural Beaded Rose that tells you lots of information about how I chose to specialize in NBR, some before and after pictures. Under my name, there's a tab that says Beauty by Lindsay, and that will take you directly to my blog and my YouTube channel, and I have just all sorts of different information. Um, my latest blog post from this week, actually, was talking about breakfast. I love food, and so if you want to sneak inside and see what I do, um, my favorite type of breakfast, um, that kind of stuff, just dig around, follow me there so you don't miss anything. Um, I try to change that up and not just talk about hair. So I love skincare and fashion and all that stuff. Um, speaking of fashion, I am wearing some boots. I don't know if you can see these. I'm garbage at this. Let's see. Nope. I can't show you my boots. I can't show you. But I am wearing this cute top from Banana Republic. It has like a cute little peplum at the back and some skinny Levi's and these cute brown boots from Night West. So fall is in the air and it is certainly in the hair. So if you're ready for amazing hair, click the link and we'll get you started on your natural beaded rose transformation. If you guys wanna know more or see more or talk about more fun like makeup, skincare, hair, fashion, food, I'm always down for food. Um, just comment below and we'll start a conversation or I can make a video or we'll do a QA. and a If you have anything you want to know about me or salon life or NBR, that'd be super fun. So comment below what you want to see and we will make it happen. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day and as always, I will catch up with you soon.